What's going on? Little Rock here with another Turntable Techniques video brought to you by DJ City and Beat Refinery. In this episode, we're going to show you how to use your mixer's internal echo effect to transition between songs with different tempos. Most super OEM turntables will have a wider pitch range to help with tempos with a greater difference. But if you're using a turntable that doesn't have this feature, you'll definitely want to use this technique. You'll want to make sure the mixer that you're using has internal effects such as the Pioneer DJM S9. In this first example, I'm going to use a transition with a song that's 92 beats per minute to another one at 108 beats per minute. The first thing you want to do is select the echo effect and turn the depth all the way up. For this example, I'm going to make the echo four beats long. So now that my hold echo is activated, I can turn my turntable off because I don't really need it. And if I hold down tap and move the parameter button to the right, I'll get to 108 beats per minute. Okay, so this time I'm going to go from 129 beats per minute to 111. Now to finish it off, I'm going to go from 111 beats per minute to 94 beats per minute. Sometimes when you're making big BPM adjustments, you're going to hear small audio distortions just like you heard on mine. Just to be safe, try to keep it within 10%. Thanks for watching this episode of Turntable Techniques. I'm Little Rock. Don't forget to click like and subscribe. We'll see you next time.